This is fucking craziness, man. I actually feel sorry for these people, man. See, some people, oh, Jay, you're so evil, you ain't got no empathy. In that. No, I feel sorry for these people, yeah? Because they're not born into a place where there's lots of opportunities in that. The man grafts all day long washing cars and then he doesn't even get a warm bed or a roof over his head to sleep under. The man has to sleep underneath a fucking bridge and rats eat his food. He's living like an animal. No disrespect to him, but what I'm saying is, it's wrong. My life is horrible. Then you got these fucking people who are homeless out on the streets and that because of their drug and alcohol addictions. And then the British say, oh, we should be helping out the homeless. And I fuck the homeless. The homeless putting themselves in that position. The homeless are not getting up every day to go and work for 12 hours a day on 15 pound a fucking day at some illegal car wash and that. And they don't have to go back to go after a hard day's graph, sleep underneath a fucking bridge and have rats eat their fucking food, blood. Fuck the homeless in the UK. Help out the Romanian people that are coming over here to work and graft, to send money back home for their family, to provide for their family. Fuck the British homeless. They put themselves in that position. Dumb asses. All of these people, 99.9% .9 of them, and fuck you people watching this right now that say, oh, what if it wasn't the person's problem? There's 1% of people where some mad circumstances happened to them. They was getting violated, so they had to run away, or they was locked in someone's basement, so they had to escape and that, or they got some mad mental issues. I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about the 99% of people who the homelessness is self-inflicted. Drug addiction, alcohol addiction, gambling addiction, dumbass addiction, yeah? How the fuck do you have no one that wants to take you in? It's probably because you're a drug addict or alcohol, uh, or you're, you're an alcoholic and that you keep getting kicked out from wherever you're going. I don't feel sorry for none of these, these, these British homeless people. Fuck them, man. They put themselves in that position. They're born in a country where they've got opportunities in abundance. It might seem hard, but it ain't that hard. Yeah? You, at, at some point in your life, you could have trained to be an electrician. You could have gone to university, got a degree. You could have been an IT man. You didn't choose to do any of those. And the ones that did decide to do that, they fucked it up with their bad decisions and that. Spending all this money. And living a fake, lavish lifestyle. Now, I don't give a shit about none of them. Let them rot on the streets. I feel more sorry, more empathy for them Romanian people and that. Because these men are just coming over here. They just want to grind. Yeah, They want to send money back. I remember in the previous episode, episode one, where the guy was over in the UK earning money so that he can pay for his daughter's leg to be repaired because she had a crooked leg because in Romania the doctor was some botched up doctor he fucked up her leg I feel sorry for none of these fucking British homeless people fuck them man